What's up guys, Coach Mandler here, Team Swole Patrol. Just finally getting over and recovering from my Thanksgiving hangover. Whole lot of family food, football, booze, and uh, kind of a wash, rinse, and repeat cycle of that for the past week. Nice way to kind of just reload, reset my body, and now it's time to refocus on the grind. So what I got for you today is a two for one, an Ask Mandler, and a Flex Friday session for you out there who wanted to, to focus on building size, strength, explosiveness all at the same time. And uh, without further ado, let's get to the Ask Mandler portion of it before we get to the Flex Friday routine. This one is a question wanting to know what can I do to build a bigger bench press while also increasing size and density throughout my upper body? Great question and pretty simple answer for you here. What I would do is this, all right? Focusing on building size and strength at the same time isn't too difficult. What I would focus on doing is sticking in that 80 to, to 90% range, closer more to that 80% range, which would be around that kind of five to eight rep max if you had to, uh, to figure it out. And what you do for the size portion is, is focus it on uh, more time under tension. What will allow you to do that is a slow and controlled negative eccentric portion of the lift, all right? And I'll show you a little bit more with this when we actually go through the routine. And to give yourself more strength and explosiveness, what I would do to match that up uh, you know, would be to kind of have a slow pause followed by just an explosive concentric portion of the lift. That will give you the effect of strength and explosiveness while matching it up with that slow negative that delivers more of the size that you're looking for. So uh, I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about in today's Flex Friday routine. Try it out for yourself. Get back on the wagon. I know the holidays are tough, but trust me, if you do this routine, it's going to mix it up and going to keep you excited about your training. So throw it in. Let me know how it goes for you. And make sure to leave your Ask Mandler questions for me by simply commenting in the section below. So without further ado, let's get to today's Flex Friday routine. All right, the first thing we have after our dynamic warm-up is going to be five rounds of a push-up complex. We're doing clapping push-ups, then these kind of like pause uh, push-ups right here. This is going to kind of, you know, stimulate a lot more muscle fibers and kind of simulate the same type of lift we're going to do in the core lift, which is what's going to really focus on allowing us to build size, strength, and explosiveness all at the same time, all right? We're going to get the size gains from the slow eccentrics that we're going to do with the lift, and we're going to get the strength gains by um, essentially pausing for that five seconds at the bottom like you're going to see right here, and then exploding up as fast and as forcefully as possible. So these slow eccentrics right here, that's going to put a lot of time under tension on the muscle fibers of the chest, shoulders and triceps as well as the upper back so that you can initiate more growth and then exploding up after that pause is going to help you increase your strength and explosiveness all at the same time which is exactly what we want all right from there it's just doing some more weak point training what we got here is a dumbbell jerk followed by a dumbbell row complex getting that heart rate up too so we can uh increase that metabolic rate burn more fat while uh, working on building a lot of the weak point strength in the bench press and working on building more muscle at the same time. The triple whammy, if you will. All right, so all these muscle groups that we're hitting with these movements are going to be uh, muscle groups that will increase our bench press. All right, uh, you know, you have your, your upper back and your deltoids and your triceps all working here with the, um, the, the, the dumbbell jerk, which is kind of heavy. I, I like sticking in that you know, five to eight rep range whenever I'm doing kind of this submaximal work, like that, that five rep range in the core lift. And then following up with some rows, which help to further increase the stabilizing strength for the bench press as well. So after that, going to do a little bit of arm work. All right, I always like finishing off Flex Fridays with a little bit of arm work, and these are my new 
favorite exercises to increase size and strength in the long head of the triceps, the functional head of the triceps. That's not going to be that just, you know, that horseshoe muscle that you see on the side. This is going to be the bigger head of the triceps, the one that allows you to increase your lockout strength and actually takes up more of the size and mass. And you're hitting those by doing this complex right here, which is going to be a decline dumbbell skull crusher followed by a decline close grip press. Uh, after that, I got to show some love to the biceps and um, a little bit of you know, uh, finishing, finishing off of the delts as well. So I got a little dumbbell curl press complex. Uh, not real heavyweight here. I'm just going for a lot of volume. Increase that time under tension. Time under tension is going to be clutch if you're trying to get as jacked and swole as possible. So just doing five reps, curl press, five reps, overhead press, five curls or uh, hammer curls right here, and then five alternating curls per arm. Ultimately, um, th this is just going to be the best way to combine everything. Going high rep means increasing time under tension, which initiates more growth. Attacking those weak point muscles is going to increase your core lift. And doing all this will get your heart rate up, which helps you burn more fat. Hey guys, hopefully you enjoyed the tips and the routine in today's video. If you did, let me know by hitting the like button, share it with your buddies, give the gift of swole, and make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any of the future tips and routines that I'm going to be hooking you up with here on a daily basis. And if you're trying to figure out how to put together programs that help build more size, strength, explosiveness, and even muscularity all at the same time, kill all sorts of birds with one stone, then be sure to pick up your free copy of the Muscle Building Blueprint by simply clicking on that button right there. Once you do, I'll take you to the next page which breaks down every module you're gonna be getting completely free of charge, as well as simply ask you where I can send it to you without you having to pay a penny. So like I said, if you're looking for a free format that helps you build more successful plans, then just click on that button right there and I'll take you to the next page which breaks it all down for you. So do that and I will see you on the other side. Appreciate your time, guys. Have a good one. Mandler, out.